Hey guys, Vada Kitty again, and welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. In the previous episode, we said we saved Valu in Dragon Roost Cabin. In this episode, we are going to go and sail out into the Great Sea. Let's go ahead and talk to the boat. It would seem that Ganon set those monsters in this place. But that would mean there's no time to lose. You must depart at once for the place where the next pearl sleeps. We sail to the south. Alright, basically what he's saying there is we can go ahead and get out our Wind Waker and play the Wind's Requiem. There we go. Okay. Now I'm gonna go ahead and set for south. And here we go. Very, very nice. Now, I actually had a failed editing thing. Not a failed recording, but a failed editing. For some reason, the movie windows movie maker didn't want to edit an episode so here i am yay boy hold it right there small fry i don't know where you got your mitts on that c chart you got there but it looks to me it's pretty much got nothing with c just drawn on it it's pathetic in fact it's almost an insult to call that thing a c chart if you ask me <laughs> What's the matter, Small Fry? I'm just trying to be nice here. I'm telling you that you've got a problem, and you do. Don't give me that stupefied look. It makes you look like you ought to be in diapers. Just listen, okay? I'm here to teach you what I know about this island, so open up your sea chart and make it snappy. Make it snappy? Where have I heard that before? Maybe in a recent 2012 video game? Okay, and he draws out Dragon Roost Island. Very, very nice. It's a real peculiar cave towards the backside here in Dragon Roost Island. Yeah, real peculiar, but I doubt you'll ever get there to see it, small fry, unless you manage to sprout wings and fly, that is. Because you won't get getting there otherwise. That's all I can teach you, small fry. But I'll do this for you. Since I'm feeling so generous, I'll send word to all my brethren living near the island of the Great Sea. Bunch of... bunch of fish. If you see a fish leaping out of water when you sail near an island, sail up to it and spread bait on the water's surface. Trust me, it's good advice, fry. The debating process allows you to get a chart of the island along with any info that might be of use to you. I highly recommend to make a habit of doing so. So you're definitely going to need a reliable sea chart to help you search for things I see. I can't emphasize that enough, right? You need a well-drawn sea chart. If you don't get a chart for every island you come across, it'll just be a bigger hassle for you later on. Don't say I never told you anything, Fry. Hoi, you there. You, kingly red lion guy. That's it. I've repaid my debt. I'm done. You take care of the rest. Alright, basically what he's saying is we can go into our items, get out our bait bag, and we can put some bait all across our thing here. And now, I'm going to go ahead and speed up the video. Um, I'm kind of sorry I can't sing there, because for some strange reason, Windows Movie Maker wouldn't want to work with me. Okay.
dreams come true In the rainbow factory When a single soul gets through In the rainbow factory Bottles, nice. Okay, gonna keep going. See if I can make it to get that one bottle. See if I can make it. Make it. Make it. Make it. Make it. Make it. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. Aww. Hey. Yes. Do you not see what rises up on the horizon? That is where you must go. Fuck me. The forest haven. And we are here. Nice. It may appear as though this is but a great tree rising far above the ocean's surface. But it is a sacred place. It is inside the grotto that you will find the spirit of the earth, the great Deku Tree. You must speak with the Deku Tree and receive from him a sacred gem known as Ferora's Pearl. I fear that Ganon's vial may have already reached its most sacred facilities. Go forth with caution, fuck me. Alright, now we're gonna go ahead and climb up here. Okay, keep climbing. Nothing should get in our way. Okay, well, except for two. New enemy, Goku Baba. No way, this is a... I'm not sure what this is. You've seen, I think I've seen these things in Ocarina of Time. They give away sticks whenever killed, and we get a new item. These are used to get uh, blue potions from one guy. Okay, there we go. Oh shoot. Uh, Alright, get another one, very nice. Oh shoot, I forgot to look at the bottles. <laughs> Okay, there's this guy named Megs who says, well, this doesn't look ominous at all. And he has a screenshot of, uh, of something. I don't know what it is. It's something, I don't know. And, and there's Karen who says, happy gaming. It's like a cute picture of Link. Very nice. And then Flea, which says, pass on this pretty little Rito face. Okay, it's just a picture of Medley. And there's someone named Andy. Hello from Andy the Pennsylvanian. Hope you're enjoying the game. Okay, which I am. Link's new ride. And it's the, uh... And it's the ship from, uh... From that one guy. And there's another one from Megs. So who wants to go down the creepy tunnel first? And Link just has a straight look on his face. <laughs> and then someone named Daniel. All these soldiers are the same, except for this one. Huh. <laughs> okay, and now we are gonna go ahead and keep going. So, go ahead and get out our little grappling hook. And oops, forgot to do it. All right, don't worry, I didn't forget too badly. Oh shoot. Uh. Okay. Um. All right, turn around. Get ready. And jump, very nice. I, I usually get very uh, scared whenever I go up there. All right, gonna climb up here, jump, and now we're going to game ourselves. I will kill that guy, and now you're going to go and see what is going on inside this thing. Ah, very nice. Nice, so uh, woody feel to it. I. Okay, there's the great Deku tree. Hey, what's up, man? Uh oh. This can't be good. This can't be good.
Come on, hit the tree. What you're supposed to do is you're supposed to run to the tree. Oh, come on, hit him, hit him. Yes, 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 there we go, very nice. Basically, the point of this is to slice as many as you can. I'm actually doing much better than the other recording. Very, very nice. There we go. And we killed him. Very good. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, uh blah, 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 blah. I must apologize. I was in error. I saw your clothing and suddenly I felt a longing for an age gone by. That longing caused my ancient tongue to pass my lips. I am the guardian spirit of this forest haven, the Deku Tree. I owe you my thanks for your aid in ridding me of those foul creatures. Tell, tell me, was it not the King of Red Lions, the boy who speaks, who led you to this place? Uh-huh. So it's true. Then you have come here because you have a need of the Pearl of the Goddess. I see. I knew when there, I knew there was a reason the monsters had begun to congregate the regions around my wood. Now I understand it. He has returned. Ganon has returned. In that case, we must make haste. Koroks, little children of the woods, this traveler is not your enemy. Let your hearts be at ease and show yourselves. What do you call yourself? Fuck me? Well then, fuck me. These are the Koroks, spirits of the forest. Once upon a time, long ago, the Koroks took on human forms, but when they came to live on the sea, they took these shapes. Now they fear people, but to me, they will ever be my cherished little children. As it happens, you have come just in time for a ceremony that the Koroks hold but once every year is about to begin. I shall grant the pearl to you once their ceremony is complete. I must apologize for the brief delay, but if the ceremony is not completed soon, an ill fate could befall us. So let us begin. Are you ready, my children? <laughs> but we are not, oh great Deku Tree! Something terrible has happened! It is Makar! Makar! What's the matter, Linder? You and Makar are always late. <laughs> no, it's not that, oh great Deku Tree! Makar fell from the Forbidden Woods! What? The Forbidden Woods? I told him to be careful, but still, Makar flew above the Forbidden Woods, and he is... And as he drew closer to it... Foolish little Makar. Fuck me, did you hear all this? The Forbidden Woods is right beside the hollowed island of our forest haven. Those woods. The whole region is the vile place that is home to evil beasts. And now it seems they have taken a child of the forest named Makar. Your presence here is no mistake, I deem. The King of Red Lions likely expects great deeds of you. It is why he brought you here. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but can you go rescue young Makar for me? But Great Deku Tree, people cannot fly through the air. Ah, yes. Thank you, child. You are right. It is not possible to enter these woods from the sea, is it? Fuck me. I would guess from your size you are heavier than my Korok children, yet I think we'd still be able to solve this dilemma. You must use the iron shop to stow upon you and fly through the sky. <laughs> Oh. Huh. Forgive me, fuck me, but could you climb up my crown and get the leaf from up there? Um, I'll gladly do that. But, I'm going to go ahead and do that on the next episode. So, next time on Wind Waker HD, you will climb up the crown and get the leaf and go to the Forbidden Woods. See you guys then. Eat bananas!